Epic Drop. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Michelle with The Blooming Basket. I want to go through a couple of uh, gift concepts that I think would be absolutely vital to have on your Mother's Day tables this year. So if you are um, going to be out there on the street selling, please, please remember what I'm about to share with you right now. So we need to make sure we have gifts available for everybody. We want to make sure that if it is a husband looking for the wife or if it is a son looking for the mom, if it is a sister looking for her sister, um, if it is a mom looking for her mom, you know, just we want to make sure we have gifts that are very versatile and um, that anybody can gift. Okay. We don't want all of our items to scream uh, best mom in the world or happy mother's day or, you know, um, love you mom or number one mom. I just things of that sort, because if, um, somebody comes up to the table and they're looking to buy something for their sister who is a mom, we don't want to just say, I love you mom. Okay. We don't want things to be, um, all up in the face about mom, this mom, that don't get me wrong. We are definitely going to have things that, you know, say best mom in the world and happy mother's day and all that good stuff. But we want to remember to have some that don't. And we also want to remember to have some that are not fragranced, you guys. We don't want to have everything be a spa gift. We don't want everything containing perfume and um, body mist and body lotion and all of that stuff that we just love to put in our baskets um, because they are amazing sellers, right? However, I recall uh, having to lose out on quite a few sales last year because I did not provide those type of items and I am definitely not going to let that happen again and if I can um, prevent anybody else from having to turn away customers then I'm here for you okay so this is just um, a reminder to those that have been making baskets but also very good information for those that are new to basket making and selling okay so the first concept I'm gonna go over is um, very very simple and easy you guys and actually these all these all are um these are all going to be very inexpensive gifts i'm pretty sure any combination of the gifts i'm going to show you um can be done for 15 dollars or less most of them for 10 or less so um let's see here the first one is finding yourself a cute cup cute mug and a cute journal um these happen to match fantastic uh they weren't a set but they are now okay so um just take the mug and a journal a cute pen you can put um maybe some tea a box of tea or some a bag of coffee or um, some cookies or you know some type of candy in here to fill it up absolutely um you don't have to but um it's definitely i think gonna help with the selling point there just to have there not be empty space unless you wanted to just top it like that and then just put a pen right here and there you go and that's your gift and you can easily do that for um under ten dollars you guys the mugs and cups um well this mug i got from burlington and most of the journals come from burlington a couple from ross so they range from 3.99 to 5.99 and um you can find mugs for, you know, a dollar on up. So just depending on what you find there. But um, that was one gift. And that there offers zero fragrance. So that's perfect. Uh, another gift you could do is taking something like a cup. This is going to be just my all-purpose uh, cup for this video, okay? <laughs> but find yourself a cute cup. Um, and a cute little gift set like this. This was from Burlington. It's hand and um hand soap and hand lotion it was $4.99 and you could just place that right there on your cup and wrap that up and call it good that's a gift for under ten dollars um there's also this other cute gifts that i got from burlington and this is um a body scrub with a loofah 
the packaging on this is just absolutely beautiful, really pretty. But oops, find you um, your cup, put that there, wrap it up, good to go. You can take yourself a little flower, put a flower in there if you want. And that there is under $10, you guys. Um, another great idea. So those are gifts. I know there's fragrances there. Those are the gifts that will work for anybody, though. Um, no matter who is getting it to gift to whoever, it's going to work for Mother's Day. Um, so the other ones are these diffusers, these reed diffusers here from, these came from Burlington. Ross has them as well. I feel like Burlington has a bigger and better selection uh, in my experience. So um, I do like to get them there. These are $5.99. Yeah, $5.99. And then um, you can just find yourself a journal that corresponds with it. Like this blue journal I got here, we'll go with this blue diffuser. It's really pretty. And then if you, you know, that there could be the gift alone. If you wanted to take it up a notch, you can find yourself a nice cup, put that in there with a floral arrangement. That's a beautiful gift, you guys, and that will work for anybody. So... Um, if you're not able to find these or you don't have like a Burlington or Ross near you, Dollar Tree also has really cute diffusers right now. Um, and they smell really good, you guys. So this butterfly blossom one, I am in love with. That is absolutely delicious. Like it smells so good. But you can take these and place it with a journal and just find some kind of journal to correspond with it and do that. Um, you can also take, let me get these out of the way here. You can also take um, just a journal and a cup there and make that a gift. Whenever I have journals though, I always provide a pen. I haven't got my pens yet, but um, I would, if I did this, I would definitely have a pen in there, some type of writing utensil there, and you could do something like that. That's going to work for anybody. Um, Dollar Tree has these tumblers back. Miss Kimberly had uh, put a short out on it, I think, video or short, and um, she hit the jackpot with these, y'all. <laughs> I've been to four Dollar Trees, and I have found zero. This one is a leftover from Valentine's Day, but they have them in plenty of colors and they are so pretty and I love these cups and I'm going to go to two other stores today in my area and see if I can find them and if not I don't know I might go on the website and see if I can order them um, but man I would love to have those because you can take something like that so um, here's another journal that I found it has um, the pen and the I don't know what those are um, maybe like um, what do you call those things? Bookmarks or whatever, or like just notation stickers for important notes you write. I don't know. But anyways, um, you can take a journal, put it with a very cute tumbler like that. And if you can find these at Dollar Tree, you're going to make this gift for under $10. So just things like this, um, all these different variations and combinations for under $10, $15. I mean, if you do um, a diffuser and the mug, and the journal, and then once you get your pen in there, I mean, you're probably going to be closer to the 10 to $15 range, depending on where you buy your items. But um, still, that is a very nice gift, and you could easily turn around and do that for $25, $30 and uh, make a nice little profit off of that. Dollar Tree also has these um, tumblers available. They are color-changing, and these are pretty cute. Um, so I would probably be using these in a few of my um, inexpensive baskets, I guess. If I can find these, um, and just, you know, to give an example, like you can tell, so let's say these are both Dollar Tree items, right? These tumblers look way more worth $1.25 versus this tumbler. It's still cute, still nice, and it is color changing. It does change color with temperature, but however, the uh, presentation of it, you know, the quality of it doesn't really exceed much more than $1.25. So just depending on what you can find to put in your basket, your gifts, to pair with your gifts, this 
is going to get you a little bit more money than something like this would get you. You know? So, just things to keep in mind. Um, but, oh, you guys, and then Dollar Tree also has these cute baskets. I love these. Have y'all seen these? Um, these are really cute. And I was thinking I would get um, one of those scarves from Dollar Tree they have. Those really lightweight ones. And intertwine it here and then put a bow in the top. Wrap it around and then tie it in a bow in the front. I think that would be really, really adorable. I haven't really decided, though, what I'm going to be doing with these. But they are a very good size. They are, um, yeah, they're 14 by 10. So they're pretty big. It's going to take something good to fill those fill those up. So I'm going to see what I'm going to be working with with that. But just an idea. Anyways, you guys. So, yeah. So these are some... Um, Inexpensive concepts, they are some non-fragrance concepts, and they are concepts that will uh, be all around for everybody this Mother's Day. So I'm going to make sure I have plenty of this type of uh, gifts available, plenty of these types of gifts available, whatever. Anyways, y'all know what I mean. But, um, all right, you guys. Well, hey, if you have any questions about anything, just let me know in the comments. I would appreciate it that you uh, gave the video a like and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Going to be having a lot of um, really good, cute Mother's Day concepts coming up this year. So make sure you are uh, tuned in for those. Guys, thanks for sticking around through the video. Until the next one, y'all take care. Epic drop.